The Nordic Talks project is realized with the collaboration of Nordic embassies Denmark, Finland, Norway and Sweden and Kitabistan and also with the financial support of the Nordic Council of Ministers. And uh, ahead of COP29 in Baku in November, the Nordic region will be uh, also a strong voice for the promotion of um, uh, efficient solutions in the international climate-related negotiations. Government policy was Finnish interest, which means that even if governments change, this target doesn't change. And the attitudes of people can be developed and they must be developed. And this is when the chain, kind of the value chain, has to start from kindergartens, through schools, to, to institutions of higher education. Then we also found out that we could do it in a way where we could reduce our energy consumption, reduce our CO2 emissions, and that became more and more important as we became aware and the rest of the world became aware and we became in, aware in the EU uh, that climate change was here and it uh, was for real. Then this issue of reducing our CO2 became, emissions became more and more important and we could see that we could reduce our energy consumption, we could reduce our CO2 emissions and at the same time have an economy that grew. Ramping up renewables is not enough to take care of the climate challenges. We also need to develop low carbon solutions. Otherwise, the transition will not go at the pace as it needs to. <laughs>